What's up, everybody? Here you go, Sean. Adola. Adola. Okay, we. I'm gonna try to share this somehow. Don't. I'm not going anywhere. We are sharing though. So if I hit more, Facebook. Next. Sure. Why not? Share. Did that work? Share to Facebook. Did it work? Hi, guys. Hello. How is everyone? Good. How are you? So we will give a few minutes for people to join, and then we'll... Get things started. Get things going. Uh, Hi, hello? Hi, Don uh, and hello. Melanie and Mary and Sarah. <sighs> it is, according to inside, it is 101 degrees outside. Mm -hmm. So, this Ken from the car is brought to you from our garage with our garage shut. Sean's like, so we had a lot of sun coming in and Sean's like, you can shut the garage. And I was like, we will asphyxiate. And he says, you can shut it almost all the way. So if I start acting goofy, it's because we're, 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 we we're got fine. gassages going on. Bomb pumps. Yes, you do. I have red rockets. Bomb pumps, too. Those I call them red rockets. Okay, guys. So first and foremost, I almost didn't do a Ken from the car. What? Because, let me listen, listen Linda. Okay. First of all, welcome to Ken from the Car. If you are new to a Ken from the Car, it is us. We sit in the car and we chat. Yes, we do. Well, you do all the chatting. Today could be a little bit of a rough day. Why is that, Sean? He doesn't care. So You're busy. I am Lots busy. to do. But let's go ahead and start from the beginning. Okay. First of all, please know that I get off track sometimes. Yes, you do. Okay. Um, can I use ink on reclaimed kitchen drawer? Yes, you can. Um, okay, so I will try to stay on track, but essentially, long story short, I am very blessed and I earned a trip mm -hmm. to represent Chalk Couture to Africa. Along with lots of love. With lots of love. Yes. Super exciting. Mm -hmm. Super fun. Mm -hmm. Lots of fucking shots. And excuse the language, but it is a lot of shots. I haven't gotten any. Okay. So. Excuse the language, but this is how I feel about shots right now. So. I. Very excited. But they're like, here's the shots we recommend. And I'm thinking, oh, no big deal. Shots make you feel like crap. My arm hurts. Do, yeah. Horrible. So, no joke. You should have done your left arm because this is your good arm. No, they told me to do it in this arm because you have more muscle because you... Oh, okay. Yeah. I work that arm a lot, Sean. Yes, I'm sure you do. Okay, so before you get going, I have to explain a couple things. Number one. Ken from the car is literally us just sitting from the car and talking about deals and things on my mind. Number two, there could be foul language. I apologize. Number three, um, because of my shots, I'm in a weird mood and this could be very interesting. Number four, please, please, please help relieve Ken's stress and use the affiliate links below that help support us because August is off to a rough start, Sean. <laughs> All right, so I think that's good for the rules. Mm -hmm. If you have a question, make sure it's all in caps. And that's it, okay? First and foremost, I want to thank everyone from the bottom of my heart. So long story short, I earned a trip to Africa along with Anne and the CEO of Chocotour and super exciting. This guy, you guys... Um, so Sean, when he left work, actually before he left work, but now that he's left work, um, he's become a major part of the Ken's Christians brand. And I am 
the, the trip to Africa is as much you earned it as I did. Mm-hmm. So instantly, Sean wanted to go to Africa. I will be honest, guys. When I earned the trip to Africa, I was like, mm. I did not like Boy Scouts because it was in a tent in the forest. I had to poop in outhouses. Like, it's not my jam. Right. But, but everyone says these trips to Africa are life changing. So I was like, you know what? I'm representing Chalk But to the point where Watts of Love CEO came up and said, we heard you are a little nervous about going into the field. And I was like, um, and I tried lying and being us. Oh, I'm not nervous. And this guy right away goes, he's very nervous. He, I, I should probably go for him. That is what he said. To which Watts of Love said, well, you could, anyone can go. You just have to raise the funds. No big deal, right? Oh, well, let me tell you. <laughs> so first of all, we had to, we found out, I first asked permission from Chocotor and who's going, can Sean go? Because I didn't want to just have him go if it was like more of a thing for us. I just, I'm that way. They said yes. So I said, how bad can it be? Well, <laughs> come to find out, we had to raise, um, part of going is you raise $3,000 for lights, which is a hundred lights. Mm-hmm. You have to pay for the application fee. Mm-hmm. You have to pay for your flight. Yep. You have to pay for shots, which are not cheap because most insurances I'm finding out do not cover shots because they are not needed. You have to pay, yours did. we have to pay for visas. We have to pay for yep. food. We have to pay for and someone to watch our travel, dogs. We have to pay insurance. for travel insurance. So anything we found out it's going to be right around $10,000, right? We are very blessed and we both stay at home and certain months we do make decent money, but Ken and Sean had a great idea of the last lots of love. We wanted to match dollar for dollar. Mm-hmm. Because this guy, listen, listen, everyone, I went to Sean, and you guys all know me, I am, have, I am not a egomaniac person, I don't like egos, when people say, oh my gosh, you're a celebrity, I say I'm just a regular person, I just like to have fun, mm-hmm. so right. when I went to Sean, I said, Sean, we need to raise $10,000 for Watts right. of Love, Sean literally said, mmm. I don't think you have enough capability to do that. And I said, what? And he goes, I don't think you're going to raise that. And I said, why? And he goes, maybe 3000 But based on what I'm seeing other people do, you will be lucky to get 3000 And I was like, you really think so? And he was like, yeah, don't take it the wrong way, but you just probably won't raise anywhere near I mean, that. You, ha- you have to look at how many people have, were doing it. There's quite a few people went and did their Watch of Love Chalk, chalkathons and stuff. Eighteen hundred here, three thousand there. Thirty-eight hundred was one of the highest I heard. So I figured, okay, maybe thirty-eight hundred, maybe so four. So Sean said, "Good luck." And I said, "What do you think the best would be?" And Sean goes, "Maybe five thousand. And I said, "Okay, are you okay matching dollar for dollar?" Because I want to make a donation of ten thousand. Sean said, "Yes." So we do lots of love. This is the one in April. We go live. People start donating, people do auction. And so at the end, we were going live five times that day. And after the first live, Sean goes, how did we do? And I said, we're at 3,500. And he was like, oh, that's with our match. And I said, no, that's just what we've raised so far. And Sean goes, oh. And I said, we have to do four more of these. So we'll probably get to 10,000. And he literally said, oh, can we tell people we're not doing the match anymore? And I said, no, you can't tell people we're not doing the match now because you guys are so good that we're not going to do that. So we stayed true to our word. We raised 10000 so we donated 10000 to Watts of Love, which kind of wiped out our savings. So my lesson learned is we will match up to a certain amount. And number two, never ask Sean what he really thinks because that's what happened. Long story short, we made that donation, and so now I told Sean, if we want to go, we need to raise funds. So, this was a long story to basically tell you. The first link down below is you can support Sean to going to Africa. Mm -hmm. Um, Any donation will work. We will be doing another Watts of Love. We raised right around six grand so far, and we need ten grand. So, we need another four grand, so we're going to do other things and stuff. So, um, everyone... 
What? That link that's on there is going to the Watch of Love, Watch of Love link, right? It is, yes. So it's an automatic donation right to it. Yes. And it's... So I want to thank everyone that came to our Watch of Love. I want to thank everyone that donated. Thank you. Um, thank you. Thank you. I am so blessed that I have Chocotour in my life. I know a lot of people, um, I've gotten a lot of hate on this channel about Chocotour. A lot of people have said, I don't want you to be pushing that down our throats. I don't care for it. I don't, you know, I wish you'd go back to this. I wish you'd go back to this. But the fact of the matter is, for what, for me, Chocotour, I love it. I'm addicted to it. It's my passion. I love everything it's brought into our life. We have been very blessed. It's a very good community. Mm -hmm. Um... But one of the policy and procedures is you can only have one designer per household. So even though Sean has grandfathered in as we used to be a pair, so it used to be that Chocotour allowed like partnerships. Well, he was grandfathered in, but they made a policy change where it said only one person can get the recognition. So when I earn trips or stuff like that, it's me. I can take Sean as a guest, but for example, this Watch the Love he can't go to. And the fact of the matter is, is Sean deserves to go he earned it he is just as much part of me and so anyways that's why we're raising the funds i don't want people to think we're just being cheap or wanting you guys to fund it um however that's the reason we are doing it um this is very very dear to my heart because we are so blessed we have electricity we have so many things so to give back is huge i'm a very big person on giving back to sure. people Yes, Sean. You have a question. You so raised your hand. JL Listen. was asking, how can you donate? Oh, um, yes. The link, it's practically the first There's a link. lion. I'll show it to you. So when you see the links in the description, That's it may not do that. super bright. <laughs> Just a sec, guys. Okay, so the first link will have a little lion, and it will say, support Sean to Africa. So any donation amount. Mm -hmm. This will go to Watts of Love. Mm -hmm. You will get a receipt that's tax deductible and all mm -hmm. that stuff. Yep, and then it our goes, goal is four thousand two hundred and fifty. Right, so that goes into there. It tells you who donated, so we all get to say thank you, and you will also be placed when you do a donation. A donation, it also puts you in the running for prizes. Yes, yes. So, and yeah. we are working on where we'll have our video cameras, and we're going to do shout outs and do a video after the party. Yes, so. Mm -hmm. Um, we just need to raise the money by the time we go. We go by September 20th. We have put everything on credit cards because we had to pay for everything already. So we have maxed out some credit cards. But that's okay. You know, I think I am not looking at this as a vacation. I'm looking at this as an opportunity to give back. Mm -hmm. um, if you just look up Watts of Love on YouTube, it's very humbling that these people live in these rural communities that don't have electricity. They don't have... Um, healthcare they don't have anything we have mm -hmm. and i'm a little nervous because i'm an emotional person so i'm probably gonna be crying the entire time because i naturally am a giver um i want to make everything i want to make everyone happy i want to give back and i'm not going to be able to do that to an extent right you will but i won't so so the answer is yes you can use that link that was on the auction it's the same link yes yep. thank you so for anyone that did do an auction thank, you. thank you we are working on uh collecting money and sending those out so, um, first of all, that is the first link. Okay, guys. So, the second link I wanted to talk to you about, and I'm super excited about this. Um, I have gotten so many requests from you uh, for branded content. And we have... Um, I'm sorry that you have gotten hate mail and etc. Life changes and you have to do what you love as a crafter. We're going to be talking about that. So, um uh, we'll, we'll, we'll dive into that a little bit more. But I have gotten a lot of people saying, I want swag and I want to deliver swag, but I don't know what you guys want. So I have a survey I want you guys to take. It is the second link. It says creator branded swag. So as you guys know, my name's Ken's Creations. I'm Ken. This is Sean. Ken's Creations is with two Ks. And I put a thing out there that says, what should I call my fan base? Because I was calling you crew or peeps. And someone came up with creators with a K and I loved it. So you guys are my creators. And I want to do swag, but I don't know what you guys want. For example, like I know pop sockets or fans or t-shirts, hoodies, uh, tote bags, dog bandanas, um, a whole bunch of things. So I, I have a, a survey out there. I want to know what you want. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. I want to know what price point you want it to be at. Mm -hmm. And then I would also want to know how much shipping it is. So please take that because we are in the process of ordering everything. And I want to make sure it's something that you guys really do want. I know pop sockets are a very, very hot off item. Fans. Um, someone had thrown out one time like bobbleheads and stuff, but those are a little bit more expensive. But I'm thinking about bringing those to my creator level. Dog bandanas for our fur babies. How cool. That's one of them. That's one of the options. So just take it. Give me some ideas. I would love to see it because it's something I want to roll out before Christmas. Mm -hmm. And we can't. Yeah. All right, guys. I wanted to talk about our new Facebook group. So, um, so long story short story time listen oh my gosh okay you know what let's do a taste test sean we are going to be tasting for your enjoyment eight pops i will be right back while we um do that and then we can chat about our next topic oh my this is what i have to deal with <laughs> so he's got he stuck them in the freezer even though they've been sitting in the garage in a hot garage for a while so here it comes here you go sean let's see what we're getting all right so we're gonna do a taste test throughout this whole thing and stuff this first one red robin uh, hurricane glasses this first one is called swamp pop a premium sugarcane soda pancha tula pop roux i don't know i don't know what that means that is french I had to pour it really slow because if I get rid of the fizz, this guy. I love the fizz. He loves the fizz. Don't don't try it yet. So it is pink. It's kind of a here a berry flavor. Here, oh, just cool. put it right here because cool. I won't drink too much of it. I can't have too much carbonation. It gives me a stomach ache. Um, Cricket says you have a wood engraving question. Can you email Sean on Facebook? Yes, you can. All right. So I hope ready? I have the answer. Very light, nothing strong. What is it? I, so it says strawberries are the official state fruit of Louisiana, yeah. and it's no wonder Louisiana is the strawberry capital of the world. So basically, this is a strawberry pop. It tastes <laughs> exactly like strawberry Fanta. Fanta, no. Fanta, don't you want a Fanta, Fanta, don't you? Oh, it doesn't? No. Oh. It has, uh, yeah, it's strawberry. All right. We need a dump box because I won't drink all this. I'll be right back. You need the dump box. But just to pop that, the ice. Pretty good, actually. Green Fanta. Oh, God, that's so good. That melon flavor green Fanta from, for, uh, what was it, uh, Thailand or something like that? No, that one's good. Uh, we actually got quite a few of these pops from, believe it or not, the Cracker, the crackle, cracker Barrel. It was very strange. Here you go. Well, I'm not going to dump the ice. Well, don't. Your hands are going to get all sticky. Yeah, I didn't. Okay, fine. Well, this is going to go outside here, and I'll just get ice for me. So that's where I'm going with this. Diamond Dots. Oh, gosh. I wish I could work on them every night, but sometimes I'm just too tired to do it because we're just so busy. Yes, I know. That's all you hear. Busy, busy, busy. I've done, uh, if you've ever seen the five-foot qu uh, koi Diamond Dots, um, if you were to look at it, I've done... The okay, upper, fine. sort of in the upper right-hand corner, I've done the three koi's are done. So three koi's are done, and um, and the leaves on top. So that's how far I've gotten. Yeah. So I've got two more. I think I've got two or three more koi, and of course all the leaves that go across. Yeah. Again, this thing is five feet long, so it's crazy. Uh, excuse me. All right, guys. So nailed it. Yeah. So this new Facebook group. So. We're at story time. Listen. Listen. So, almost a year ago, a little over a year ago, I left my job at the bank. Mm -hmm. That's right. And I decided to go and do this on my own. So, from May to September, until I invited Jazzy to join me, I was pretty depressed because I was by myself. Um, I was doing a lot of stuff. All of this stuff. Um, so, I had Jazzy join and it took us a while to work out our kinks. Mm -hmm. And then in March, Sean wanted to leave his job and join. Um, the thing you guys don't see is 
in the root of me, I like to make people happy. I like to make my fans happy. And I literally, um, when I started doing Chaka Tour, it took away from Ken's Creations and Patreon. I had all these groups. Um, and I got really overwhelmed because I was doing so much, but I wanted to make people happy. And I started saying, oh my gosh, okay, I'm not doing as many car tutorials, or I'm not doing this, I'm not doing edited. Um, and I started getting overwhelmed and, and stressed and all this stuff, right? Give me a break, they keep doing that. I um, had all these Facebook groups and all this stuff. So I read comments all the time. I don't let comments get to me, but what I do let getting to me is I hate disappointing people. I hate it so much. Um, and I get to the point where I just get so much on my plate because I'm a yes person and yep, 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 yep. And then it's just too much. So we have some announcements. First announcement is I've shut down pretty much all Facebook groups except for my Ken's Creations official Facebook group. Um, I want to say thank you to everyone who supports us or uses our links or stuff like that um, and joins our groups and do, does stuff because that does help support us. Um, but ultimately, at the end of the day, there is one of me mm -hmm. and it's just too much to keep up with. Yeah, that's right. So we've shut down all the groups except for this one Facebook group and we want that one group to be our, our one-stop shop. Our next announcement, which we haven't even told that many people, is I have Jasmine. Jasmine works Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Mm -hmm. I've got an eyelash in my eye. <laughs> okay, look, we can all wait for you because do you need to go, go inside and take nope, care of it? it? Okay. So um, Jasmine works Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, very short hours. She does a lot of my social media. Mm -hmm. Sean was doing a lot of my editing stuff, but it's gotten to the point again where Chalk Couture and my team takes up a lot of my time, so I wasn't giving enough attention to my Ken's creations, and my affiliate money started slipping, and I was dropped by Cricket and all of this stuff. So today we interviewed someone who actually is my nephew, and we have decided to hire him full time. Mm -hmm. And he is gonna, with Sean, start doing more edited videos for Ken's Creation, so I can concentrate on my team with Chalk Couture because they want more training and stuff. So, if you guys want to be part of the new group, it's brand new. We're almost at 10,000 members. I want to get to 100,000 members by the end of the year and give away stuff. I have amazing, amazing, amazing. Uh, admins in there and stuff so I'm super excited um, to bring Ryan in and we are going to have a lot more on air with him he's going to be producing our live videos mm -hmm. he's going to be doing videos with Sean so I'm super really excited for that of course this is going to be a full-time salary so hopefully we can bring in enough money to cover that we don't need to be millionaires we don't even need to be hundred thousandaires we just like to have fun and do this so anyways um, join that group um, make sure you are part of our uh, Chalk Couture YouTube channel. We're going to go live there this afternoon, so I'd love for you guys to be there and be with us. Um, also, I'm revamping our Patreon. Um, Georgia says, can you incorporate Chalk Couture into card making? All right, guys, I will be 100% transparent. Um, so when I started Chalk Couture, it was brand new, and not a lot of people were doing it, and I started doing it on Ken's Creations. We have a compliance department um, that wants to make sure everything is, of course, in compliance and fair. And about three months ago, and I'm not, this is no one's fault, but because of Ken's creations and stuff, as designers sign up, I was getting turned in because essentially people would say, he, you know, does stuff for cricket and silhouette. He really shouldn't be doing chalk couture because our policy says that should be separate. So they asked me to separate Chalk Couture mm -hmm. completely out, which I did. So I technically can't do Chalk Couture on Ken's Creations anymore. Um, so that's the reason why I've separated the Chalk Couture out. And also to make it more defined, because I get it. As, mm -hmm. as Chalk Couture has grown, that's become what we're getting recognized for. That's what people are getting to know us for and stuff. So I can do Chalk Couture on Chalk Couture, but I can't incorporate it into Ken's Creations. So that's why we had to separate the channel out. 
Um, but uh, part of it is our Patreon is getting a revamp because... By having my nephew come in, we are going to be doing some stuff on our Patreon and creator levels and more rewards based around um, swag versus other things. I have, um, in the process of hiring a digital or a uh, okay. an illustrator, um, I don't want to go into too much deeps, but I need an illustrator because I'm working with someone that I'm very close to and hopefully will be releasing a product line soon. Can you do Chalk Tour on those cards on your YouTube? Mm, yes and no. Kind of. Kind of. Um, so, t basically, long story short, is if you want to support us on Patreon, look down below. If you want to um, check out our new video tonight, it will probably be around 5.30 and we will be going there. Is my Club Couture group gone to? Nope. Club Couture group will always be here. It's just hidden. Only members are going to be there. I'm in stuff. So, you know what's so funny about Chalk Couture is... A lot of people will come up to me and say, oh my gosh, you're the reason I joined Chalk Couture, but they don't join my team. Um, because, weird. well, I think it's because little, we, we need to go numbers. live more. Mm -hmm. All right. So anyways, we're going live there tonight. So this last thing before we talk about sales is a shameless plug. I've given you a link of the new Ray Dunn Orange Halloween that I need. Um, I know a lot of people always say, I don't understand why you get so around Halloween into um, Ray Dunn. And here is the deal. I am, we have no kids. And Sean's often asked, why do you decorate for the holidays? Because we don't have kids and it's just me and him and enjoy it. So I totally decorate for the holidays. Um, Halloween and Christmas are very ingrained with memories of my mom. So I still do it in memory of my mom. Mm -hmm. And so this turns into a hard time for me. So instead of having it being a hard time, I would much rather decorate and honor my mom's memory yes. and stuff. So that's why I like to do um, uh, the holidays and stuff like that. Um, so if you're out and about, just look. If it's an orange ray done, I would love it. Mm -hmm. I'll pay you right away. All that stuff. So if you guys know... Um, this tends to be, it will be interesting this year. Uh, this tends to be the time where I start struggling with my mom's death just mm -hmm. because it is, she was so into Halloween and Christmas and then she died right after Christmas and stuff. So it gets better, but it still is a hard time, um, and stuff like that. So anyways, okay guys. So that is all the links on there. I do want to talk about some sales and then we're going to talk about some other cool announcements. Um, as you guys know, I have gotten a lot of questions on Cricut and why are you no longer a product expert and all that stuff. So essentially because of me going to um, uh, so much with Chalk Couture, Cricut made the decision that I wasn't doing enough Cricut stuff and so they dropped me as a product expert, but I'm still an affiliate. And so I would love it if you guys still use my links and support us and stuff like that. Um, but we don't get to do the mystery box anymore. We don't get advanced notice on anything. So that's why, like, when the new Maker Tools came out, I didn't have them yet. I still don't have them because I'm waiting for drop ships um, and stuff like that. Uh, but it's, it has been good, too, because it's opened up where we can just kind of do and say what we want. And we're not being, you know, guided on doing this or that and stuff. Whatever. Okay? Um, so I do want to talk about the sales. Um, and stuff. If I'm not myself, which I guys, you guys know, I am usually like all happy and everything like that. It is because these shots, I had to get the rabies shot and it's kicking my butt. Rabies shots, the, the doctor before he gave me that shot said, this will be the worst shot you've ever gotten. And I was like, it's a rabies shot. Oh, M. my arm feels like a bomb went off in it and it hurts so bad. And I just feel under the weather. Why is that? Yeah. Why do you feel gross? Because that's what it does to you. All right, Sean, let's try our next pop before right. I talk about sales. Can you grab ice and your well, yours? This is Old Brooklyn Coney Island Cream Soda. Where's yours? Right here. So I am a cream soda snob. I love cream soda, but it has to be... A good cream soda. Yeah. It's going to be really good taste.
Nothing fancy. You know what? Everyone keeps telling me rabies shots is a series of shots, and they said it was one shot. Yeah, on my piece of paper it says you get one, and then you get another one, like, seven days later, and then another one either 20 So why is mine is just one shot? Maybe it's new. Maybe it's different now. I don't know. I don't like that. You can dump mine out. Okay, guys, so let's talk about sales, and then we have a lot of other stuff I want to talk about. Make sure you guys do that that survey. I really want to know what you guys think for for uh, swag and stuff. Um, Nancy, I'm not sure if Jasmine did, but I will double-check that when I get inside the house for you. Um, she unfortunately did not work today. She did not come in today, so I don't know. Um, that's one thing... Uh, before I talk about sales that is becoming more and more clear to me. I wake up every morning, usually between eight and nine mm -hmm. and it's just all day long text messages. And if I turn on my phone every five seconds, it's going on. Right. So Bye. I try to get back to everyone as soon as I can, but it's been kind of crazy. Yes. It's ah. a series. If you've been bitten by someone, so with yours is just preventative. Prophylactic. I'm preventative. Yes. Is prophylactic. Yeah. Um, okay, guys, so here is the sales, which are really good. If you are an act, not an Access member, you should be. Um, the ones that I do want to say is all Cricut mats, including Easy Press mats, all paper and iron-on is 40% off. Nice. So if you use my coupon code, which is Ken, K-E-N, mm -hmm. you get another 10% off for that way. Yep. And if you're an Access member, you get 10% off. So if cardstock's normally $10... It's six dollars. If you're an access member, it brings it down to five dollars and forty cents. Mm -hmm. Then if you use Ken, K E N, it brings it down to um four dollars and ninety two cents. So it's a really good deal. Tamitha, could you repeat that in the group itself? That's K E N so people don't get K E N people don't get get crazy and go If but here is the deal. If you're a Cricket Access member, you also get twenty percent off all Cricket totes. 40% off nice. all machine tools and 40% off all regular crafting tools. Nice. But, but not the new Cricut Maker tools. No. However, the new Maker tools, they have new bundles. Mm -hmm. They have a quick swap everything bundle where you get everything for 140 You can just get the actual tips all for $60, which normally they would have been about $100. Nice. Um, or you can get a smaller uh, kit for $80. So, and there's new items. There is Martha pens that they released, mosaic vinyl. It's awesome. So check all of that, you guys. So here's the deal. One of the great things about me no longer being Cricut product expert is they really wanted me to shy away from silhouette. I'll be honest. They were like, Ken, when you do your Ken from the car, can you not talk about silhouette? And so that was kind of our mutual decision of me to walk away because I get it. They wanted a product expert to just be Cricut, um, but I that's not my deal. My deal is to show you guys everything. So Silhouette, um, now I can do their mystery boxes and talk about their sales. Mm -hmm. So they still have their mystery boxes. You can get the small one for $50, the large one for $100, and there is a ton of stuff. And they have, bye Pam, um, they have 10% off everything if you use my code. So there's two mm -hmm. different codes. To get the mystery box, it's KK Bundle. If you want 10% off everything else in their store, it is um, 10 off. And if you use the links down below, we get um, credit for that. Thank and then I also give you the links to everything else down there so you guys can support your favorite stores by using our links, which we thank you in advance. Thank you. Thank All you. right. I didn't want to spend too much time on the sales because I don't want it to be that. I want to talk about other stuff. Um, but definitely take a look at them, and it's so awesome. Mm -hmm. All right. So um, you can dump this out. Let's try our next pop, and then we're going to talk about some more stuff. Ooh, Sean, mm. this one's apple pie. Mm. You guys, look, apple pie cream soda. Okay, give me some icy ice. Mmm, this is going to be so good. Ooh, my God, it smells like apple pie. Okay, hold that. Smell it. Mm-hmm. It okay. smells a lot better than it tastes. Uh, I don't think so. I think it's actually pretty good. I like it. Ken, can I use the Silhouette Glow-in-the-Dark transfers with chalk? What? 
Whoa, whoa. Yes, you can. Oh, glow in the dark ink. Yes, you can, actually. You just want to clean your stencil right afterwards. Right away. All right, I'm done with that. I'm very underwhelmed with that. Okay, cool. Different. All right. Very different. So different. here's the deal. Okay, bye. Who's leaving? I don't know. They just said bye, so I said bye. Um, okay, so here's what I'm super excited about. So by hiring my nephew, um, he is going to be doing a lot of videos for Ken's Creations, which is really, really cool. Uh, so we are super excited that we are going to be still doing our lives, but we will have a schedule and they're going to be doing a lot of the videos like project videos, how to use vinyl, how to use iron on all that stuff. It's going to be him and Sean. I'm really excited for it. Um, and hopefully it helps increase our affiliate revenue yeah. and all that stuff. Cause that's the whole idea. Um, I am really excited because we are turning Ken's Creations channel, of course, into your stuff that you guys are requesting, but also to bring you into our lives and go on shopping trips with us and do more of this. The funny thing is, is I put out a survey of what videos you want from Ken's, from, you know, Ken's Creations. And, um, the funny thing is, is I thought you guys were going to, these were the top four. Ken from the car taste tests, unboxings, and um, uh, shopping hauls. Yep. I thought it was going to be like, we want to see vinyl videos. We want to see HTV videos. Nope. They, they just wanted these. Isn't that crazy? Yeah, we'll still do those. We will still do this. Yeah. So I'm really excited because this is going to... Um, What are, I why did that. you move me? Because I couldn't read oh. your hand was like this. I can't right. read it. So anyways, um, I'm really excited. Uh, but with that said, uh, it's hard because I try to make everyone happy. I try to do it. And I just, mm -hmm. I don't have enough time in the day. If we had 40 hours a day. <laughs> and these shots bad. are kicking my butt. They shouldn't, but they are. Yes, we will be doing videos on the Cameo 4. Oh, so Yes. Uh, so that was my next announcement is, what are you doing? Oh, sorry. Um, we, hey Simon, how's it going? Hey, guys. So, um, September 10th is the Cameo 4 release. Mm -hmm. We were invited and we we're invited as one of their premier people to go in an hour before everyone else and do videos and show it off yep. and stuff. So I'm working closely with them because I do want to emphasize. So up to this point, I've been very clear that the Cricut Maker is my machine of choice. It is the best machine on the market. Um, one of the main reasons I think I'm no longer a Cricut product expert, I will be honest with you guys, is we did a video on the Cameo 4. And in that video, like we, we were too excited about it. <laughs> um, so I get it. I'm not upset. But I just want you guys to know that I will never, ever, ever compromise on my commitment to you to be unbiased and to get you the information, even if it means in the long run it hurt us financially, mm -hmm. which it will. Mm -hmm. It is what it is. Yeah. But to me, getting you guys unbiased things that don't sway mine is more important than anything else. Did we, uh, Renee was asking again if we know if it was open to the public. I don't know if it is open to the public. So, yeah, yeah, it'd be fine if it is. I'm sure it's a cost, but yeah, but then again. um, yeah, so I 100% um, unbiased reviews over money every single day and, and everything, mm -hmm. even when it comes to Chocotour. I go out and try competitor products, and if I find something that's comparable, I will let you know. I have not yet, I have tried competitor products, and they are not as good quality um so you get what you pay for but anyways um silhouette cameo will be the beginning of september we get back from that then we go to africa if i survive that we get back um and then basically october or november and december we will be doing some cooking stuff with sean we always do our, our baked good stuff and all that stuff but i'm really excited because by having an additional person here mm -hmm. ryan mm -hmm. we will have three people working on videos to get you guys more content, which I'm super yep. excited about. Mm -hmm. So, um, and I'm excited just because I can focus on you guys and having fun and everything. Uh, so 
Yeah, I'm excited. Sweet. So am I. Are you excited? Yep. What are you most excited about with having Ryan come? Uh, just having somebody help me because it's because I'm always doing it all by myself, and this way we can kind of work together and get more done faster. I don't think people realize until they start working here how busy we are. Yeah. It's crazy. So I bet like, you so Simon like, is feeling that now. Since yes. he has a product line, I bet you he's feeling how busy it is. Uh, it takes Simon, a lot. I, I am the videographer. I used to work in TV, both news, sports, and... This is Rose Cream Soda. And production of... Uh, I don't like this already. This smells weird. No what smell. is that? It's probably rose water. What's rose water? Isn't that what you put on your skin to make sure Satan stays away? No, that would be garlic. No, garlic is vampires. <laughs> what did you say? Rose for what? Don't you like splat? Oh, no, that's holy water. That's holy water. Oh, my God. Yeah, Ryan is um, his uh, <clears throat> his older brother's what? Uh, younger son. Oh, do you like this? This is horrible. No, thank you. You there's don't... Nothing, there's nothing great or bad about it. It tastes like a rose. I've had I've had rose water and it's this is gross. Fun. I can't. I can't. I, you can dump it. I, yeah, but I can't I'm done. Do it until I do this. Not good, guys. Not good. So we're just gonna do four, not eight, because eight's too many. Yes. Not good. What do you mean we're not gonna do eight? You're not, you said we're gonna do eight. I'm going over. No, we're not. We're doing four. You said eight. Oh, oh, sorry. I lied. Um. So yes, I'm super excited. I'm excited because for me, I've made a lot of crafty friends in the industry. Simon. Um, Auntie Tay, mm -hmm. and that's why um, we say hi. Well, that's why we say hi and stuff. And we know that. Um, everyone asks, when are you coming out with a product line? I'm in the works. I'm very excited. I just don't know what direction I wanted to take it, but I think I finally have toned it in. So once I can give you more information on that, I will. Um, oh, cool. So cool. Maybe it is open to the public. I did not know that. Yeah. Very cool. Um. So very, very excited. We have excited things coming. I'm just excited because getting more help, hopefully I can get more content and stuff. So um, my big fo focus has been Chocotour. I love it. I have a great team, but I need to get those teams what they want, which is being leaders and stuff like that. Um, Ken from the car will never go away. Uh, in fact, that's the whole reason of bringing my nephew on is I just don't have time to produce a video, come up with the concepts, edit it, voiceover, and everything. Sean, lovely Sean here, did just edit four videos for Ken's Creations, and he realized, oh my gosh, how much time and energy and mm -hmm. effort. So by having my nephew come on, we'll have a team of four people. So kind of like uh, Tanner Bob Bell's done on his channel, he, him, he invited his friends, and sometimes he's not even in the video, it's his friends, you're going to see the same thing here, I'm going to be introducing Ryan and Jasmine, and you might see them doing a video, um, so I'm really excited about that, so I can Please, do it. Simon knows, videos take hours and hours to do. My machine videos, when I compare machines, so when I did the brother versus cricket versus silhouette video, oh that took three weeks, we had to film it, well I had to come up with it, film it, edit it, voiceover, all that. Carol says don't edit and voiceover. So we um, will be doing that. Every Tuesday we will be going live on um, something. It might be um, like yesterday is does this crafty item work mm -hmm. where we just open it and try it. Right. Every Wednesday will be Ken from the car. But my goal is every Monday, Thursday and Friday will be a quick video upload um, and stuff because here's the deal some people my true fans my creators you guys are awesome and stay through the the um, thing but if I don't do those other edit videos we don't broaden our channel and we don't get those other people right. to watch and, and there's, click yeah, those there's a lot of people that are looking just for that and they're not gonna want to watch an hour live they're gonna want to watch that mm -hmm. quicker type thing which is what we've done before even our other machine uh, we're a little long, but we'll be able to get them down to a better time so they have that time to be able to literally see what's the difference between the two or three or whatever we're doing. Yeah. Because lives, obviously, when we do lives, are very long, but when we do the edited, short, to the point, and yeah. that's for those people, too, because we want to be able to do those as well. Yeah. You did um, live yesterday trying something. We did. We tried the Spectrum Noir... Um, tricolor, uh, tri are they tri? Yeah, tricolor markers, and we loved them. 
they huh? i definitely feel those those markers are for brand new crafters these huh? markers are designed for people who do not know how to blend don't know color combinations these are not a permanent solution <laughs> but um they were good markers i thought they beat the chameleon and stuff like that so that's kind of what we're gonna do and i'm gonna tell you guys that there's gonna be things that i don't love people that like to make glitter tumblers i think are crazy i did not have fun doing that um so that's kind of what our lives are going to be about sweet and stuff we yeah. will always do ken from the car mm -hmm. um and as long as you guys continue to like ken from the car and support using our links down below and it makes sense financially we'll we will do it unfortunately at this point we have to i have to follow where money is and right now chocotour because i have such a great team and i'm building it that's where the financial part is coming the whole reason I was able to leave my job and Sean was to leave his job is because of Chocotour. And that's why so much focus has been put on that. But I want to make Ken's creations just as big as, as I want it to be. But if it doesn't bring in revenue, I can't because right. we got to follow the revenue. That's just all there is to it. And some people think like, oh, just because, you know, if you have a product line, you're going to be rich. Not necessarily true. People that have product lines... A lot of people, I mean, you might only make 15% on that. You might yeah. only make 5% on that. It all depends on what your agreement is. But it's a lot of work to come mm -hmm. up with it and then to support it and get it out to yeah, the sure. creators. And it's fine. We can tell you exactly because he's yeah. got that going on and he knows. Yeah. So I think some people think, for example, not just throwing names out, but like Tim Holtz, people are like, oh, he's got to be rich because he has a lot of stuff. And I don't think that's necessarily the truth because you don't make a ton of money on a product line and the amount of work and mm -hmm. production. Not only that, but you guys have to think of if it's not made in the United States with tariffs, that's all impacting it. And it's, yep. there's a lot of stuff that goes into it and stuff. So I love how alcohol markers look. I just can never make it look right. Alcohol markers are a lot harder. I think water brush markers like the Zig Real Brush or the Arteza Real Brush, they're a lot more forgiving mm -hmm. than alcohol markers. Alcohol markers, I will say the new Arteza alcohol markers are very forgiving, and yeah, I do like nice. those. So, yeah, nice. yeah. Anyways, that is an update on Ken's Creations. I'm really excited because um, I I know it hasn't been given the, the uh, efforts it needs to be. There is a 60-acre fire burning two miles of Cataldo. There you go. There's so much smoke in our air right now. Um... So anyways, I'm very excited. Hello, Angela. How are you? Hey, um, and stuff. What else did we want to tell them? Is there anything else new and exciting? We talked about the Africa trip and donations. And thank, thank you, JL, for doing oh, that. Oh, thank and you. And else who's done one. Thank you so much. Um, we talked about Ryan. Mm-hmm. You'll probably see Ryan in about two weeks or so. Correct. He's a youngin'. He's a young and don't say that. That's hilarious. Um, <laughs> well, he's only 19. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, the Africa. We t Oh, and don't forget to take that survey, please. I want to get Branded Sway going, but I want it to be stuff you guys want. So, very Moderator. excited. Moderator. That usually means there's a troll. Yeah, I think there was. I thought I, thought I saw something, but it went by so darn fast I didn't see it. Somebody said something about... I'm glad I'm watching a live that doesn't have color. It's like, really? Uh, there we go. I think I got it. Did I get it? Okay, I think I got the right person. Was it the J Jada? I think I got it. What did Ann say? You need to watch. Oh, thanks, Julie. Julie lives very close to us. Okay, good. We got it. Um... So unfortunately, when we do lives, if you get, I always notice right when we get to 200 live viewers, the trolls come out. Yeah. I don't know why. I think something happens and they can start watching us. Yeah. So we got it. Don't you worry. Oh, thank you for the $10 super chat. No, Guess what? My, um, oh, and there's another person. Well, we'll wait till that person. They always will say something else. Don't you worry. Um, our Chocotour channel just got monetized. Yay! Yay! Which means they'll start showing up in search results more and everything like that. Yeah. So, super exciting. Thank you so much for that um, and stuff. So, yeah. 
what do you guys have any questions before we leave because we are going to try to do it is four o'clock and i want to go live in about a half hour on our ken's creations chocator channel so if you are not part of that channel or subscribe the link is here we will be going live there on facebook and on chocator ken's creations channel we're doing a big to-do list for our office so i'm super excited there's another one. Oh, I got him. Don't you worry. All right. Any questions or guys? Let's see here. Oh, I think I did. Oh, maybe not. There we go. Got him. It's like a, it's like Buzz, Lice, Buzz Lightyear's Astro Blasters. Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> pew, pew. So just a heads up. If anyone wants to go to Africa, be prepared for a lot of shots. So yesterday I got three shots. A week ago I got three shots, and I still have three more to get. Mm -hmm. wah, Which ones you wah, have? Well, some of mine are pills. Wah. Well, yeah, I have pills coming, and then I also um, have a drink. I love of course, you're doing your malaria differently than I will be, probably. What, how did you do your malaria? I probably just malaria pills, where you're doing some kind of a weird antibiotic. It's a drink. You're oh, that's enough. a malaria. That's your malaria one. The one you take two days before and then four weeks after. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff, guys. I'm telling you. Um, oh, you got a puppy? <gasps> what? I want a puppy. Uh, yeah. Um, so I'm super excited about it, but we'll see. So, all right, guys, we will be over um, on that uh, channel probably in a half hour. So we're going to let you go because I don't see any questions. Mm -hmm. So jump, make sure you are part of that. We are going to be making a huge board. This board is how big? I think 36 inches wide. By 48 oh, no, inches? No, 48 by 36 or very close to that. It's big. Yeah. So make sure you guys check that. Look for the alert on that. And we will see you guys in about a half hour to 45 minutes. So see you guys soon. Thanks, everyone. Bye. Bye.